Hi, uh, welcome to Danny Side Sketchbooks Volume 8. I just want to make footnotes on Danny Side Volume Sketchbook uh, uh, 2. I said that, uh, just, just quips, just random stuff, because I speak opinion, not really citing my resources, but uh, from the second sketchbook, the... We inform people are hardworking. They're, they're, they are living the American dream. Still on the Canadian dream, what it was for our parents. It's nice to see that they work and just have normal jobs and pay their taxes and drink beer and collect money and all everything. And it's really cool. The other thing is uh, that picture I drew in volume, volume uh, six. Uh, that woman, the glamour photo, that was uh, drawn from a picture. I drew her live as a picture and not a photo, a picture. I drew from the picture of her the glamour photo. The realistic one was drawn from, I drew a picture of her and then from the picture I drew a glamour photo. But here we go. We're going back to 2012 here. This is Art Duro Botto, Lonely Knobs Club Soul Band or whatever. Uh, or Lonely Knobs Glove Band. That's what it was. Lonely Knobs. It's all robots. It's all based on the Butlerian Jihad from in the kit right of the Carantinian Duke of Combination, the War Against the Thinking Machines from uh, Frank Herbert's Dune series. I read all six of them. They were awesome. Uh, but anyways, they all we have a war against the th thinking machine called the Butler and Jihad. It's really the harmonica thing for us. Hilarious. I'm like, come on, Elon Musk, let's buy this shit. Fucking destroy your own robots. Who cares? <laughs> That's Captain Lou Albano, the wrestler from uh, WWF. WWE now, not World Wrestling Federation, World Wrestling Entertainment. Cindy Lauper in Albanian clothes. Uh, I made her as an Albanian because he's Albano and she's Albanian because she played the daughter in the in the music videos. Here's uh, that guy who played Long John Silver from Romania, uh, and he's drinking rum. And I made him a robot. It looks pretty slick. Uh, I documented my car accident I had in the snow. It was around a really dangerous turn. Uh, I was so lucky. I had forgiven this on my first accident. I really don't want to drive again until I smoke. I think, I think uh, insurance would appreciate if I quit smoking when I was driving. This is a Levon Helm from the band. I remember these people. These ones I do. And this guy was uh, someone in Elton John's band. These people died in 2012. Levon Helm was from the band. He was the rival in, in uh, egos or whatever between Robbie Roberts and Levon Helm. But uh, I think they were amicable at least. I don't want to get the tabloid shit. But this is a Portugal. These are port. This is a Portugal. This is a po porch, uh, a Portuguese porch. These are Portuguese, and this is a Portugander. It's uh, Portugal with a robot Portugal. Here's uh, the White Brothers. What were their names? Uh, Johnny Winter, Albino Brothers. Johnny and Edgar Winter as a guitar playing, uh, piano and keyboard playing, a dual robot. Here's. Humphrey Bogart is the Maltese Bogart. Yeah, it's looking at you, kid. Here's uh, Mean, what was his name? Mean Ween said he cut me, and he said, Mean Ween cut me, and he said he was kidding. They have him on the Leonard Cohen album cover on uh, the pod, the Ween's the pod. Uh, and then uh, he has the ventilation mask, but he's like Darth Vader, and I mean him brown, a brown Darth Vader, but he has the weed ventilation mask that they use a Scotch guard to clear out the air with. Here's El Clino. There was a Mexican with a golden conquistador hat on. It's cultural appropriation. Elixir de la Juventud de El Camino y Toronado in Cord Cordoba. Uh, it's fountain, fountain of Youth for cars. Those those car truck cars. Here's the here's the 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 Netherlands one. Uh this is uh, Michael Bublé in uh, in uh, 
What was her name? I forget who that was. Oh, how could I forget that? She was hilarious. She was a stupid tramp. <laughs> she fucked up her life. She, you know, I don't know. I don't get it. I don't get it. She was an alcoholic or something. <laughs> she was a partying in Amsterdam in the hot tub of guava. And there's Rip Van Winkle. It creeps me out, the swastika and uh, uh, windmills, but they, they actually look like that, which is so creepy, you know, uh, to think of that mechanization of, of wind m machinery and Germanic fucking concepts. I don't know. Here's Gene Ween. Look at these high, no one's ever seen these except me, really. This is a highly rendered drawing of Gene. They're doing studies. Uh, some of them are funny. There's Diener. There's Diener. There's Diener. That Diener is pretty good. Uh, here's Giener when he's younger. That's a younger Giener. Raises his head up. There's that famous one. I drew that one before. With the hair all wild. Here they are as, uh, Austro-Hungarians. He has a monocle and, uh, he has a, I put a mouth on. Oh, cheat teeth. Here's more drawings of Diener and Diener. There's Diener. Diener with a cigarette. That's from the fishing one. This guy was from the Killers. This drawing, I don't know who he was. I don't know who the Killers are. I just, he died. I saw on the headlines. This is Yoshko Shavli. This is what I said in the last in the Venetic theory, this Aryan theory that poet, a poet came up with translating some untranslatable inscriptions in the Alps and he died on my birthday but I still pay tribute to him because like I I I it, it's it, it's coincidence that I'll never prove true or false and I just had to pay my respects to him if if something happened because of me it just why would he die on my birthday like a couple of days before I got him die you know? It was just fucking something occult or something. I don't know. And Courtney Love uh, got sued, sued or something, and I made Courtney Love like law. And uh, here's all pictures of Courtney Love with glamour photos. I was just trying to get her face right. She had, her face was different at certain points in her life. I don't want to talk about that, but. Uh, everyone's face changes as you get older. It, I think the face I was drawing was like at 35 or something. Tweets. Courtney loved tweets. I would rewrite her tweets for her. On second thought, why don't I file a lawsuit for Slender? I, I need it. I, I could use a new suit. It's funny. I just I just try to support her with write better Twitters that are more fucking self, self-assertive and more confident for for being uh, uh, strong and independent. I don't know, it's hilarious. It's just encouragement, moral, moral, moral encouragement to some someone you don't even know. 50 watts, it's just some jabroni musician or something, it's hilarious. And Courtney just posed and they're at a party. And I did that like 30 seconds and it turned out so well. It's funny, it just shows you as a real guy. He's just a real nobody. This guy was from the Jimmy Flamian. I think it's Jimmy Fram Flamian. They're Dennis Flamian. From the frogs died in 2012. It was just creepy because I made a frog cartoon. I felt so guilty about it. And there was a woman I creeped out when I was talking about stuff like that. And like, you killed the frogs. You know you did. You hurt the frogs. I'll never trust you. Or you're stop grossing me out, whatever she said. But. Uh, frogs were like ween before ween, and uh, they were known for the 90s as some sort of underground band that was, that was influential for their bastard lyrics and fucked up songs that were, some of them were funny, but most of them were just disturbing. They're legends. Fro he died that year. He went swimming and died. I don't get it, I don't get it, I don't get it. Why, he's like a frog or something that never came back up for air. Maybe he went to an amphibious world, I don't know. It's just scary. I felt so guilty for nothing. It's from someone I didn't know. I killed him with my frog cartoon. Ernest Borgnine. 
Sergeant Fatso Jetson from Here to Eternity. Yeah, this one got taken down off the molecular DNA. It was a copyrighted photo, but I drew it. It turned out so well. The expression on that guy's face, like his face is awesome in that mug of coffee. He was on uh he was on uh Oh here's this one. This is this is Princess Marie Adelaide of Luxembourg. No one's ever seen this on the on my website. Or my I mean not my website, on my YouTube channel. Uh, but that's the Burger King, and it goes over that beautiful woman's face. And she has a burger with the brick fortifications of Luxembourg. Uh, Luxembourger. I was in Luxembourg for a World Cup. I heard the Italian sector cheer when that head, that tick grabbing guy, that uh, Zidane head butted. That was pretty cool. This is uh, Kevin Sorbo and Lucy Lawless as as Mwari Midgets Hobbits Mwari Ma ho uh, Midgets Hobbits, uh, and there is a Swiss Army knife. It's a general knife. Swiss general knife. Here's a narwhal with the robot legs. Narwhals have a spiked tooth that comes out like a tusk. Indiana Jones. I made a joke on Indiana Jones because it's India. Indira, Indira Gandhi. Indiana Gandhi. Uh, that was the name of it. And she holds the, the wheel of India. It's hilarious. Like, it's not really her. India is not a real Indian. He's, uh, he's, uh, it's his cool name that he chose. I named the dog Indiana. I named the dog Indiana. The, Sean Connery says, The Rock of Gibraltar. That one's hilarious. I love that one. Oh, Nina. Uh, I was a gobbagool to Nina. I don't know what Nina thinks about me anymore, but I'm sure she still watches. Uh, just on her, uh, her, her, her fan site and on uh, Facebook, I lost it when I was unmedicated. I mean, both one time I was, uh, yeah, both times I was unmedicated, I gobbagooled some stars. Uh, I think they knew that I was harmless, but I explained to them I'm trying to get my life back together, but that's... Nina Hagen as a Lego diva with uh, IKEA Lego furniture and Hagen Dazs ice cream. Oh yeah, Hagen Dazs ice cream. So cute, Sibjorg. Yeah, uh, I gobbled Bjork too, but I hope she at least didn't assassinate me yet. As hopefully, keeping my fingers crossed, Bjork don't assassinate me yet. Uh, I'll never bother your question thing on your, is gone now, but, uh, I told her about this drawing. <laughs> I, funny, I told Bjork about this drawing as soon as I did it. <laughs> I contacted her, so, I hope she, I hope she liked it. It's so cute as the Bjork, like, uh, Jean-Luc Picard, uh, on Star Trek The Next Generation was low cute as the Bjork, a Borg. She's so cute as the Bjork. And we are, we are the Bjork. You will be multi -comprised. That's how she would talk. And they're all plugged into EVE Online, which is a nice landing space simulator that my brother plays. It's funny, uh... Uh... No, it's not funny. No, Bjork could have had me assassinated. I swear when I was in the hospital, she left a bottle of Konig's Waster there for me to drink. And I, I could have drank it if I was actually that fucking crazy. I would have drank it. I, would have, I just thought it would turn into gold. gold. I thought it would be made of gold or silver and live for 6,000 years. <laughs> like, what the fuck was wrong with me? I could think I was in the hospital. And I'm medicated by court order now. Thank God, I realize the medication's good. This is MCA. This is MCA from uh, Rip from uh, Beastie Boys. He died in 2012. This is a, a teenage picture of him. Here's the Arctic Roboto's Lonely Knobs Glove Band. This is on the album cover on my Ween Form propaganda. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, there's Cartman and his mom. There's a rainbow. That's the Beatles rainbow. That's the Beatles color for a rainbow. This is what you get to see from the Kim deal. This is for the Japanese robot, Arctic Roboto. There is also a wife. I can't use my fingers. Don't point your fingers in Korean culture. Uh, Arc Duchess Min, Lonely Tao Soul Band. 
Uh, that is the Korean bride, and she has at least half the power. At least half the power. This is Roman Polanski and his wife that got butchered by Manson. Even though I don't like Polanski, I think he's worse than Manson. I still paid my respects to him and his wife, because it's not a very still living person. Never should have happened to him. Probably made him even more sick of a person. Here's, uh, 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 this is, uh, Cypress Hill as Star Trek. Those are the Greeks. And the, the amazing technical dream coats are the Turks, are the black guys. So the, the white guy, the white guys are the, are the Greeks and the Turks are the, the mulatto guys from, uh, from insane in the brain, brain, insane in the membrane, insane, insane in the brain, insane in the membrane, insane got no brain. <laughs> Love that song. It was a hullabaloo to her for my generation. Here's the Newt Rockney, uh, uh, potato head guy who talks like that guy who goes fairy tales can come true. It can happen to you if you win one for the Gipper. For a hard, you will find probably narrow a mind if you win one for the Gipper. And there's Monica Lewinsky. So that one was from uh, the the Boog Island. Here's Mel Brooks. Uh, what was his name? The other guy with the Mel Brooks movie. You know, there's Marty Feldman and there was the German lady from, uh, all from Young Frankenstein. Uh, uh, what was his name? There's Mel Brooks again. There's Mel Brooks again. Oh, wow. Mel Brooks. Mel Brooks. What a tribute. Oh, Ray Finkel from Ace Ventura, Pet Detective. Sorry, I don't got any Ace Ventura, uh, Jim Carrey stuff. No, I did trip to Jim Carrey. I did. I did. I want to meet Jim Carrey one day. I do. I do. He was from Hamilton, only like 40 minutes away from your, from our trailer park. And I knew it was to be poor in my 30s instead of growing up. But that's Dan Marino. And that's like, not laces out, don't touch the ball. And that's Ray Finkel, the woman with the mustache. Here's Andre the Giant pulling, uh... Uh, Andoran, uh, Andorra the the midget, Andorra the midget robot pulling all the 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 tribute that Andorra has to pay to France and Spain, the king of France and the king of Spain for the last five hundred years. Here's Miss Bugnish, a, a la Aphex Twin, uh, window licker. Uh, you can't see what the titties in the in the poontang look like on. On uh, the fate, what the person looks like on the Ween for the we not the Ween album, uh, Chocolate and Cheese from 1993 or 1994, but it's got the Ween belt on it. But I I thought that'd be hilarious if Aphex Twin was the window licker was was what that was. Uh, there's a grocer, no, there's a there's a that one's even grocer. No one's even seen that. This one, the Egyptian one, yeah. This one's cool. There's actually a scarab beetle god. That's a scarab beetle. I put the beetles colors on it from Sgt. Pepper. There's a cucaracha. Uh, you know, you're supposed to show every limb in, in one, two, three, four, five, six, six. I drew the limbs in the back there. There's that, that, this Kukaraj is not missing limbs. They drew them on the back. You're supposed to draw every limb in Egyptian art. You're supposed to. These were the Biancas, La Bianca, T Sharon Tate, La Bianca murders from the Roman Polanski thing in the Helter Skelter. Uh, this was the official photo released after they died. Helter Skelter by Leo see the book. Smitty County, 1986 novice, baseball champions. Smitty Joe, Bullfest, 1997, third plus Russ Gogelson. That's pretty hilarious. Fambo, this is hilarious. 
Let me put this up closer. Yeah, Fembo, the complete wife beat and housewives exercise kit. Uh, Fembo steroids, Fembo dumbbells, Fembo brass knuckles, Fembo punching bin. Your abusive husband's face here. Picture of husband flips over, reveal mold and mildew stained tiles when he's home. <laughs> Instructional video. I can't read this anymore. You can read it. Send in this coupon to receive free PMS instructional video. That's hilarious. Here's Rosalie. I told you about Rosalie. She's beautiful. She's so beautiful. She said her hair's brown. I drew a brown here. This is Rosalie like this one. She actually, I actually colored it twice. This is a place you're going to draw it today. We never went on it, but you can see the suggestion of Rosalie there and me. Some place in Amsterdam we were going to pretend to go on digitally. A mouse. Zombies pulling out their teeth. That was for a coupon. Sauron Jewelers. That was for a coupon. Uh, this is Grey Pilgrim Pipeweed. There's Gandalf. You see how big they are, and I put this on a coupon. There's monkey brains, vegan monkey brains, tofu, tofu monkey brains. I think that was. I don't know if you can see this. This Courtney. I did not kill him. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did not kill him. I did not. Oh hi, Dave. Story's pretty good, but he's writing his crap. Screw this. I'm leaving. This Courtney love going for script reading of the room by that 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 uh Tony Tommy Wiseau. If you never heard of Tommy Wiseau in the room, it's fucking hilarious B movie. It's just so shit. It's considered one of the shittiest movies ever made. It's fucking hilarious. Matlock, Donald Duck Dunn. Never heard of him. Someone Ween for him told me about him. Uh this is the guy from the Bee Gees. Never liked the Bee Gees, but. They're, they're good people, good people, I admit that. So I drew him as the cowardly lion, the guy who died that year from the Bee Gees. They're just gentle people. Seems like from the media. Here's Ar there's a Franz Ferdinand with the Mr. Rogers sweater on. Here's Arc Duke Domo Origato, Mr. Roboto from the Styx so-called concept album that they fired the one guy from the band for making. He never got to play with the band again. I don't know. He sucked. Kind of why my idea didn't work because they followed a failure, right? Shoes in a dumpster. Oh, this is called cool. Chuck Berry, John Lennon, and Yoko Ono. No, we're not looking at that one. We're not looking at that one. No, we're not looking at. Oh, yeah, we can look at that. There's a dodo bird. That's for a coupon. For a wean form of meme. Pretty much a meme coupon. Here's Courtney Love, not on my dime, mister. I really like that one because I did foreshortening on the feet. I shrunk the feet. That means everything I got to do on her, do for her, I have to do for free. Because it doesn't matter that she doesn't know who I am. I know I, I done her wrong. I have to make up for it, even if she doesn't know I'm making it up to her, what I did wrong. Uh, that is Nickelback as the Austro, as not a Rostro, Russian Empire. Uh, that was, uh, can't we all just get along? That, that LA riots. Uh, Rodney King, he died 2012 too. No, we're not looking at that one. Uh, that's Archduchess Sophie. Duchess Sophie from uh, the, Ar Ar the Austro-Hungarian Empire. Dali After Effects Studio. That's my YouTube channel. I actually had a project that never went anywhere. It didn't make any sense. It's funny because Dali's art didn't make any sense. 
My galley after effects workshop did not make any sense. It did not make any sense. We simply made promos or something that didn't make any sense that I was gonna teach. I was gonna teach something that didn't make any sense. <laughs> Here's Arctic Roboto with the jukebox in the Mr. Rogers sweater. This is what you get to see from the Kim deal. This is uh, the Butlerian Jihad. Uh, Archduchess Myung Sung or Queen Min. Uh, Empress Myung Sung. Uh, she is playing a Korean Bipa. Uh, I made it glowing blue like a lightsaber with the little uh, uh, I Ching uh, Yin Yang symbol on it. Uh, she's a robot. And uh, yeah, the Koreans are going to build her maybe. I don't know. Or the South Koreans. Or the North Koreans and the South Koreans work together to build this Empress cultural robot. The cultural robots will, will rule over our culture and memorize all our databases of all our culture. There's a, there's a supreme leader, Kim Jong-un, Anya Hashimnika, supreme leader. There's a fan for the music video I made with supreme leader. Uh, here's a hallucinogenic. Coupon, cool kit, cat nippon, hallucinate it up. Ron and Sasha. Ron and Sasha invented L LSD, I think, or ecstasy. I don't know which one. Chemical laboratory, and we're first to experiment with it. Uh, here's Courtney Love, and it's seen the match the colors of a TV show I worked on for kids. Georgia Circus, just like, fuck off, I'm not that sweet. I thought that's pretty good saying for Courtney, too. Fuck off, I'm not that sweet. Ah, uh, that's from Kerfuffle. We're going to the end of Kerfuffle. That's when uh, Mark Twain, Tesla, and Harriet come and leave. This is when Twain and Tesla and Tubman say goodbye. There's a steamer going away. There's a vanishing point. I'm not even going to show you all these. I'm going to flip through because these are all my story too. Oh, that one's really cool. I got to show you that. Look at those deed dough. That really turned out good dough and deer. Wow, what a great picture. Uh, I've seen so many deer growing up. Here's a Mark Twain and Tesla having whiskey in marmalade schnapps with uh, Lauren and Catherine. Here's some shapes again. You can see all the different ones. It's star scaffolding in uh, hexagon cubes, star cubes. Uh, the star loops on the end, the, the extraneous loops, all the colored shapes, the, the, the figure man, the star man. Just taking a break from finished drawings. You can see this is a master draw a sketchbook for the most part, lots of finished drawings. Two crows represent the Austro-Hungarian Empire, the Blackbirds. Here's, uh, I'll explain it. That's a bar in downtown St. Catharines, Kaz is not open anymore. That's from Kerfuffle, I'll explain that in Kerfuffle. That's from Kerfuffle, there's Tesla with the guitar. That's the finale to Kerfuffle. These are all from Kerfuffle, there's me as a clockmaker. Here's Kim Gordon and Harriet Tubman. With all the Rat Pack and Count Basie Orchestra. Here's Merritt in a town from the canal view, Old Canal. The little town, canal town, St. Catharines now incorporated into St. Catharines. Here's Harriet Tumman's shop. And here's, uh, here's, uh, the, the Swellen Canal behind St. Catharines downtown proper. I even included some old buildings they saw. In the back of the boat. That's pretty cool. All right, so uh, this one was from 2012. Uh, it's pretty lighthearted. There was some Manson stuff in there and Polanski stuff, but it's tasteful. It's not the, it's trying to find the hidden light in dark places there. It's just respectful stuff about them. Finally, I got my head out of the gutter, but you can see uh, 
the development for this Butlerian jihad that never just, just a paper tiger is simply a lunatic with some some existing fiction book, you know. All right, see ya. Bye.